TV 111. This is 4 I'm back at y'all again. I got. I'm about to leave Cincinnati. I came up with some friends, and I'm gonna allow them to ask some questions now before I leave. They have a few questions, so if they want to, then go ahead. Okay. So, um, is it true that a second sun is rising, and that that has part to constitute with um, the Caucasians uh, going underground, and is that part some way true with the global warming issue? Well. I'm going to answer the signs, the signs that's actually coming back, the new signs. The signs that it's talking about, if you go into Revelations in the Bible, it talks about a sun rising from the east unto the west with a sword dripping in blood. It's not talking about a literal sun coming back with a sword in his hand. Mm -hmm. We know that sword represents war. Right. It represents, whenever you go to war, something changes. Mm -hmm. If you go into a house and you tear that shit up, it's not going to look the same way it did before you went into the house. Mm -hmm. So when you talk talking about new signs, when you talk about binary signs, when you study the children, black children's brains today when they're coming in, and you study the children's brain from the age, it's different. They mm -hmm. have a new strand of DNA. They're even born today with gray hair. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So the thing is, when they're talking about new sons coming in, they're talking about a literal people or a literal being that's coming back into an existence that has always been here but has been in another dimension. Mm -hmm. So now you have other dimensions coming in. Okay. You get what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. the thing is, it's right here. When they're talking about global warming, you touched on global warming. When they talk about global warming, they're not talking about the world heating up. They're speaking in code. They're talking about a DNA within a certain people that's heating up. Mm -hmm. Because black people are the sun people. Mm -hmm. We are light beings. Mm -hmm. So therefore, what happens with white people when, it, you know, what does the sun do, do to white people? It mm -hmm. burns their ass. Mm -hmm. Because of the cells, that, the type of cells that they have, their cells is more thinner than our cells. And they don't have keratinocytes. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And they're melano, they don't have melanocytes as well. Okay. So the thing is, it's right here. When you're talking about new things <clears throat> being born, it's actually talking about the mind. Okay. He's talking about the mind. So the binary standard that's coming back is the evolutionary um, birth of the mind. We have a new people with a new thought. Extraterrestrial. Mm -hmm. When you say beings living underground, your mind is the underground. This is mm -hmm. what the beings is living at. This is what the bitch queen Elizabeth know. This is what the people at the top know, the Rockefellers, the Rothschilds. Right. They've studied our history. They've yeah. studied some of the books that we have. So therefore, they are they are the people <clears throat> with the strings that's controlling the matrix. Mm -hmm. So therefore, they know that this is happening. In order for them to stop that, the more black people that wake up, the more paradigm shifts we're going to have, which is going to be bad for the vampires mm -hmm. or the reptilians, which is them. So you got his story and you got mystery. That's right. So, so the thing mm -hmm. is, it's just like mythology. Mm -hmm. Even though a, myth a mythology is something that they, uh, under, under European terminology, say that it don't exist or wasn't real, right. everything has reality in it. Right. Because it wouldn't be brought forth, whether it's in the Matrix right. or whether it's somewhere else. Mm -hmm. It's here in front of you. Mm -hmm. So therefore, you have to decode it. That's all you have to do. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah. So, um, I had seen on uh, the television, they were doing some testing in a, a New York subway system and um, testing just all kind of um, the, the different DNAs that may be down there, the different uh, generals, bacteria, germs. Uh, a okay, <clears throat> so um, they did a lot of testing in the New York subway and... Uh, some of the things that they came up with was like different um, plagues that were around, uh, one being blue something, some other disease like, you know, blue, polio, cholera, all that type of stuff. Um, they found human, um, small percentage, the least amount percentage was human um, uh, genera or DNA or whatnot. And then there was another type of DNA of something else that was not of our species um, that was there and well, they had well, not this identified is, this it. Is the thing, this, this is the thing right here. It's nothing new under the sun. True. When you, when you study the geographical area of Atlanta, mm -hmm. you have to understand that Atlanta deals with the sixth chakra. Mm -hmm. You see, just like your body has energy centers and chakras, the universe do too. Mm -hmm. So the thing is, this is where the great old ones fell at that time. At a period of time where the, the equator was shifting and it subdued their brain. Because mm -hmm. a lot of Africans say, well, if we built all this great pyramids and all this shit, what happened to us? Mm -hmm. Evolution happened. Mm -hmm. Evolution happened. So the thing is, what, what actually suppressed us or subdued our brain is coming back to help us to rise. That's, this is what you call the return of the greater ones that Bobby Hemmings is talking about. Mm -hmm. And Atlanta is a part of the geographical area of the universe where if you study that this is why they have underground laboratories in Atlanta right now, for an example. Mm -hmm. And they're trying to pinpoint the certain Africans or the new African bodies that's coming about mm -hmm. so that they can experiment on them. Mm -hmm. But they can't pinpoint it because they don't understand spiritual science. Right. They only got 33 degrees of the sciences. Mm -hmm. 
You get what I'm saying? So the thing is, when you go into Freemasonry, the highest degree that a um, that a white person can get is a thirty third Mason, right? They can't go over that. This is why they can tie their tassel down on, to the side of their fast, and they can mm -hmm. only wear it once a year. Uh -huh. And you know, we can break down the signs of that too. But the thing is, that says that you know, when you when you study in these sciences, you have to understand that it's more than thirty three degrees. That's right. not they're they're not even out of elementary school yet. Mm -hmm. They're still in they're they're, they're still in kindergarten. Mm -hmm. They haven't passed elementary school yet. So the incorporation with the, with the 33, just like they try to say in the Bible, uh, he had to live 33 years before he can be crucified and take, you know, token right. into the spirit. And then um, the um, Egypt reign for the 32nd dynasty of the 33rd was a cloud and it was the rise of the new 33rd Mason. Right. Right. Um, so they incorporate that number. And so many ways but they misconstrue you you know what i'm saying right. with the with the the jesus thing uh, right. well, the whole bible is astrological <clears throat> um it's a book of science if you don't know how to look at it mm -hmm. in a way where it's metaphysical then you'll be lost it's like eating mm -hmm. processed food mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying i'm talking about for the brain the womb of the mental right so the thing is when you're looking at christ down to age 33 you, you're studying freemasonry even when you go into the book uh starting in the book of Matthews where mm -hmm. the king told the three wise men to follow the star to the east that the east of star is the king part of the Freemasons. It's the you know, woman. Right. It's elementary shit. So the thing is mm -hmm. with Christ down at thirty three, that's just saying that, you know what I mean? They they putting their own language in there yeah. to kinda, you know, put us at um at odds with ourselves. Even when you go into Revelations, you study on your DNA. Mm -hmm. So six, when six, it's six. Yeah, so when you study the mark of the beast, six six six, it's six, you six pro it's us. It's six protons, you know protons neutrons, so, and electrons, right. But when you have people that are stuck in religion who, who think that's evil, the way you think can affect mm -hmm. your your evolution. Mm -hmm. Or it, it affect the way that you manifest as far as when the universe is doing something, you have to be in tune with it. Mm -hmm. So if, you, if you're not on that vibratory frequency with the universe, mm -hmm. when it's doing, when it's shifting, then therefore you won't be stuck here in the matrix. This is why it says Satan can't take as many as he can with them. When he said that, he's talking about mind-wise. To keep them thinking on that level right. within the matrix. Right. They still plugged up. Just you like when they show... Um, they show uh, what the so-called beast is supposed to look like. It has the the the, the human body. It has the go head. The it. Right, it's as above, so below. Above, it's your so higher below. self and lower, lower self. self. Right. But when you look at pictures, right? I can throw I can throw a subliminal message in it to make you think, okay, that's negative. Mm -hmm. And it's going to touch a part of your brain to say, mm -hmm. I ain't fucking with that. Yeah, because you already put it with a lie. Fucking with yourself. Right. That's like commit suicide. Right. You get what I'm saying? Because so, you already put it with a lie. Right. Exactly. It's already put with a lie. So exactly. it's easier for a person to grasp it rather right. than to think intellectually about it and separate with, it. All they did with the Bible was, if I go to the grocery <clears> store, right, mm -hmm. and I pick up some. Something with ingredients with it. Some mm -hmm. of my product in this degree. And it says, all right, protein, vitamin C, vitamin D. But then they throw a big word in it like triglycerides. Yeah. Black people don't know what the fuck that is. And they're not going to look, look it up. The, all they're going to look at is those three good components, which right. the white man says good. And they're going to buy it and start eating it. Right. And then it's going to tear them down because mm -hmm. all, they, all they allow their minds to open up to see is the stuff that... They can understand. Yeah. They weren't willing to think out the box to go and do the research to see what, the other what the other stuff is. Right. Was. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's no. what religion is. So they place God in religion. Mm -hmm. So because God is in the Bible, mm -hmm. they say, okay, well, fuck the devil. We, we, we don't see the devil um, not killing people. Right. But we know that God is a good person. So God can get away with killing people in the Bible. Mm -hmm. God can get away with letting people rape other people. God can get away with killing babies before mm -hmm. they come up the wombs right. and allowing people to take land from other people. Right. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Because it's God. But they don't see what the devil is not doing. Right. They don't see the devil killing. Right. You get what I'm saying? You don't see the devil allowing people to right. take land. You right. know what I'm saying? But we, we don't look at it that but way. See, I figure, you know what I'm saying? If it, It's like this. Like, okay, since we were created so-called in his image, you know what I'm saying? We were created in God's image. Well, God killed. God stole. He did a whole bunch of stuff. You know what I'm saying? So if we, was created, if we were created in his image, shit, we should be able to steal kill and we shouldn't have to be asking for forgiven for our sins because truth be told as far as they're concerned we've already uh been forgiven so why the f we still need to keep asking for you know what i'm saying forgive that's according to them christians you know so you know uh always found something strange about that you know well, that's even because that's not our god well look, i understand that now look, you know religion is like getting a plate <clears throat> with no food on it mm -hmm. because when you get a plate with no food on it you're eating something that's not there. Right. So when you're believing in a God who's not there, mm -hmm. and then you can look at the situations that we're going through in black communities, mm -hmm. then you will see that, okay, well, if God is a he, for an example, we know that uh, we know that every he in the world has testicles. Mm -hmm. it's who is his mother? So who is the, so who's his mother? Right. And biblical cord, so who was God connected to? It's his mother. That's who I'm God. trying to find out. You right. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, you know, 
we don't we don't stop to think about that. Right, right, right. We only think about the shit that was beaten to us psychologically. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And believing is 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 it's uncertainty anyway. So knowing is a, is a fact, you know what I'm saying? So when a person, you know, use the word believe, you know, most of the time they don't even understand the magnitude of uh, what they're saying. Even believe the word lie, be it's, lie. Right. You get what I'm saying? Because so, be lie, believe is right. it's, it's just it's, what it it's is. It's just like this, man. It's not true. Every, everything, everything has frequency behind it. Mm -hmm. If I walk into a room that's white, mm -hmm. I know that's not good for my megahertz mm -hmm. or my chakras. Right. Everything white, it's just like the white sugar, the white rice, it's not good for you. But if I walk into a room and I got a headache and it's green, mm -hmm. it'll actually be good for me to walk into that room and lay in that room for at least 24 hours of all the negative electromagnetic waves unplugged from that room. Mm -hmm. Why? Because this is why everything in nature that you eat that is green is good for you. Mm -hmm. Colors have frequency, mm -hmm. which is ingredients. Mm -hmm. So if you walk into a white room and we know that white ingredients is not good for you, the white rice, the mm -hmm. white sugar, and all that bullshit is not good for you. See, this, but this is way past people's thoughts. Right. People don't know that the way you say something can affect somebody's health. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The, mm -hmm. the, the, the type of people you got around you and the way that they think can affect your health. Absolutely. The way you beat a drum can affect your health. Mm -hmm. The way you chant, the way you hum. See, we like to give all the credit to Indians talking about they invented the rain dance. No, they didn't invent the rain dance. <laughs> right. How the fuck did they invent the rain dance when there's nothing new under the fucking sun? And exactly. we all the goddamn Native Americans. And right. Native Americans, the so-called Native Americans were black. Right. And then a lot of people like to say, well, the Greeks invented this. Oh, this is Greek talk. This is this. No, no it's not. Well, the, the first Greeks were black. Right. So if it's Greek talk, then it's my motherfucking language. Exactly. Even, exactly. even English is our language. The if you say that white man didn't bring anything, then you have to understand then they didn't bring English neither then. Right, exactly. Because English is not English. The, the language that we speak here is American. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? English is what? England. The right. British colony. Right. British, you know what I mean? All they so do is they, pick, they piggyback and offer shit that we brought. Oh, yeah. Of it's, just like, it's, it's just like you taking some honey, mm -hmm. right? And we know that honey is built, honey is a part of a great civilization, right? Mm -hmm. And I go to that honey and I say, you know what? I ain't got no history, so let me take that honey and add some salt to it. Mm -hmm. Knowing that's not good, right? Because when you eat honey and salt, don't you know that right there shuts down the cells? It it, mm -hmm. it, it stops the nucleus nucleus from being able to receive the hydrogen and the oxygen from the cells. It mm -hmm. tears that nucleus down. Mm -hmm. So what I did is I plagiarized your civilization. Your honey was a civilization, so I added salt to it, which fucked it up. Right. Now it's not natural. This is what the white people done. They mm -hmm. came in and plagiarized everything. Now, even the cross is not theirs. It's ours. I don't know. The cross is on the t is on the wall. So you right. go to Timothy today. It's on the wall. Yeah. And people like to say, well, no, that's ours too. It's just that you have to understand that the cross represents four um, major points of astrology, which mm -hmm. is air, earth, water, and fire. Mm -hmm. That's all it is. The sun is on a cross, mm -hmm. which is the cardinal point. And they wanted to, they tried to scratch out the scriptures uh, or or uh, uh, a literature above the cross, so that you know right. one wouldn't know, you know, from which it actually meant, and so right. they used that and. Right. You know, the Ankh is pretty much the universal cross, and so right. which we know. But. Exactly. So it's good talking to you. you yep. Know. Um, hopefully I'll come back to Cincinnati. You know, y'all keep it going here. Black Science TV 111, 0 4 I'm out. Peace.